Hi and welcome back to another video of Medic Notes. This video is on cardiac cachexia. Cardiac cachexia is a state seen in heart failure, where the patient has significant body wasting, that affects all types of tissue but especially lean tissue. A current definition proposed is an unintentional non-edematous weight loss of more than 6% of previous weight, over a period of 6 months. Regardless of BMI and in the absence of other cachetic states, such as cancer or hyperthyroidism, Cardiac cachexia is usually caused by congestive heart failure. The pathway to cardiac cachexia is multifactorial and complex. Key elements thought to be involved include neuroendocrine abnormalities, counter-regulatory responses to heart failure, cause increased levels of angiotensin II, aldosterone, renin, and catecholamine activity. These in turn, increase basal energy expenditure and cause a catabolic shift in energy. Immune system activation where myocardial injury, increased gut wall edema, and bacteria, can induce an immune response, which causes an overexpression of TNF-alpha and other cytokines. This brings about an increased metabolic rate, decreased protein synthesis, increased proteolysis and other catabolic processes. Neuroendocrine, immunological, and other factors affect the orexigenic and the anorexigenic pathways to favor decreased energy intake and appetite. Malabsorption Gut wall edema in congestive heart failure reduces absorption of nutrients and may alter permeability, allowing endotoxins to enter the circulation and further stimulate the immune system. Cellular hypoxia. Chronic low cardiac output deprives cells of normal required amounts of oxygen, producing less efficient metabolism, and a shift towards catabolism rather than anabolism. For its sign value. Although only seen in 13 to 36 percent of CHF patients, the onset of cardiac cachexia heralds a poor prognosis. That's all for this video. Thank you.